is uh, 610. It's time for our entertainment update. So Jersey Shore, Mike, the situation has gotten himself in a little bit of a pickle because he's accused of not paying his federal income tax of $8.9 million, and he may be going to prison for 15 years. We'll find out. Um, he's going to go back to court in Newark on February the 8th, and uh, that might affect the Jersey Shore reboot on MTV. We'll have to see about that. I'll give you all the details. They can shoot in prison. <laughs> That'll be a fun family vacation, right? Well, she was the first American woman ever to land that triple axle jump in competition. But, of course, when I say the name Tanya Harding, I don't think you remember that. I think we all remember the baton attack on her opponent, right? What a sweetheart she oh, was. Oh, she was just a sweetheart. She's getting good reviews, though, this uh, I, Tanya. Yeah. yeah, and now tonight on ABC, you can watch uh, Truth and Lies, the Tanya Harding story. It's going to be a two-hour special, so... I, I'm going to watch it, just curiosity of how she's going to, you know, try to redeem herself there. And a uh, fan of Michael J. Fox as I am, and all of you out there who are, are going to be really happy to know that he is going to be in the cast of Designated Survivor. He's going to be playing this Washington, D.C. Uh, attorney for the president. It's going to be good. So, um, anyway, that's Yeah, I like happening. him. I would watch that just because yeah. he's in it. Yeah. I'm just so glad that he's back and doing something again. And that is today's entertainment update. Center